All right, guys, uh, another full day of eating with Max. Yeah, last one, 34, went over so well, even though it was 18 minutes long, you guys uh, enjoyed it. You enjoyed the, person, uh, the impersonation stuff, which uh, maybe I'll do some more of that. Today, heading home from the girlfriend's house, I need to stop by Kroger, maybe pick up some food. Uh, it is 11.30, haven't had anything to eat yet today. Macros still for today is gonna be 65 fat. Oh God, car, uh, 65 fat, 350 carbs, 200 protein. I might have to start dropping my calories a little bit next week, a little bit, just because my powerlifting competition is a week sooner than I thought. So just need to make sure I'm like, you know, 164 for that competition. Um, things got to do today is going to be edit up a lot of videos, go to the gym at about four o'clock. And other than that, just hang out. It's a nice day outside. Still didn't change more oil, which I said I was going to do in the past couple videos, but we'll see what I eat today, guys. Enjoy the video. I'll tell you what pisses me off in living in the city is that all the time they'll have these, um, like look over there. See how it's blocked right there? They have these damn, uh, like, people who do cardio. Crazy, right? People do, uh, you know, running or cycling and they shut down the whole damn city. So getting to my house, I have to go all around the place. It really pisses me off. So I'm like, I'm gonna take like a 10 minute detour to get to my house because of people who do cardio. They don't shut down the street. People, people you know, they don't shut down the street for people who want to deadlift a whole bunch on uh, on main roads. You know, they don't shut down the street for those who want to, you know, bench press on the street. But oh, you enjoy running. Stupid. All right. Uh, I think I might stop and get some food actually because I'm lazy. Oh, Max is just having to go all the way outside the damn city because of cyclists. Lord. You know, and I could have literally gotten on the highway right at my girlfriend's house and looped on the city of the highway, but I didn't know that this was happening. So I'm literally crossing the river. God, this is annoying. Cyclists, the cycling thing. God. I'm about to like figure out how I can get on the damn highway. Oh my god. On the highway now. There's the city. This is so annoying. This is where I should have been if I'd gotten off or you know, my girlfriend's house or gotten on the highway next to my girlfriend's house. But I got I got a good feeling that once I get off the highway, I'm not even gonna get to my damn house. Ugh. So finally made it home. Even though I should have taken it that way the entire time, but I didn't know that the damn race was gonna happen. But we're home now, and guys, steroid rage is real, as you guys saw. So, not gonna stop and get food, because there's nowhere to stop, and so, gonna make something in my house. We'll see what we got. All right, guys, now I know that I've eaten you know, hot dogs in the past. So I think we're at past the point where you get upset if I don't if I eat the same thing. But so you have two cheese dogs, 18 grams of fat, two of the potato rolls, which are the best type of bread with mustard because you don't need ketchup unless you're a female. Uh, one banana, 16 ounces of skim milk, and one serving of the Hershey's light chocolate syrup, which is only uh, 12 carbs. So again, I was gonna do something different, but. I was frustrated, guys. I was frustrated, and this is what I'm gonna eat. So it is about 12 o'clock, and got some cool stuff to show you guys. Gonna enjoy this first. We are just gonna call this Max Gets a Bunch of Free Stuff today. So, what do we got here? First of all, I've been waiting like six weeks for this. If you go to the Quest website, you can like try out one of their bars, and they'll send you one. They actually sent me two. So, go to Quest, and they'll mail you two bars. Um, now I, I thought it was only one, I swear. I thought I'd just put this one, but they sent me this one, I guess, to try out, even though I've already had it. Quest bars. And then Cellucor sent me, um, now, by the time you see this video, I'll have the codes up, but I do want to, like, offer y'all, I mean, I, I don't, you know, a little bit of discount if you want to buy them through Tiger Fitness, uh, some Cellucor products. But they sent me Icy Blue Raz pre-workout, C4, love C4. Alpha Amino, Lemon Lime. Haven't ever tried this. And then I think they know that I'm cutting. So the P6 Extreme Black. Now this is a, let's see here. 
No. What does that say? I don't know what that says. No trick. No no. Not tropic. I don't know. Eh. New. Nootropic. <laughs> Nootropic. Uh, testosterone technology, legend, legendary anabolic agent. So, 90 capsules. Not really sure what exactly this is. But it looks expensive, and it looks like a grenade. <laughs> so, and then of course you saw the MTS stuff if I put that clip in there, but... Yeah, max get free stuff. But, you know what? Companies only do this because, you know, they want me to make them money as well. So, gotta give back. All natty, guys. This took way long to do, <laughs> but I put all my supplements that I have right up here, if you guys want to know. Now, I don't take all these, but I just have all these. Pretty cool, though. Probably going to Instagram this, so go look at my Instagram. I'll put it on the screen for you guys. Thanks. So what I'm doing is editing up the video of me and Van, the collab which you guys have, should have already seen by now. Um, look at, this is all like live talking, and this is like commentary down here. I put a lot of time into editing these videos, so I hope you guys enjoy them. What I do for the audio, some people ask, is I, I record the audio on my phone while I watch it, and then I email it to myself up here. See? New recordings, or new recordings, and then I just save them and then transfer them over here. So. Hope you guys have already seen this video. You should have, because you should be watching every single video I upload, not just these day meetings. Just playing my game. Everyone wants to know what this game is. It's uh, Path of Exile. Pathofexile.com. It's free. Every character you've probably seen me. Oh, look at that guy. He's got a cool skull. Jealous. Um, every time you see me play this game, my character's probably died because I play hardcore. So if I die, I have to start all over again. Um, gonna eat Quest Bar, the Chalk Show Cookie Dough. Which is, I think, the best, personally. That's just me. Uh, you know, however many grams of fiber. 17 grams of fiber, 21 grams of protein. All them carbs. Alright guys, gonna eat this, and then probably go to the gym a little bit. So, for a snack for the gym, I'm gonna have a Greek yogurt. And one serving of light, or reduced fat wheat thins. Got this wheat thin cam. Now these plum, this plum Greek yogurt is very good. Now I'm going to the gym in about 45 minutes. So 16 grams protein, probably 17, 18. 18 grams protein, probably I don't know, 30 carbs. You like, like my candle? I always like to set the mood when I'm just hanging out by myself. Pineapple mango. And I got a pumpkin pear over here. Uh, by the way, today is chest day for the gym, but I'm not going to film because I have so much footage to, um, so much footage that I need to use that I haven't yet, so I'm going to have to make a bunch of videos and then not actually film this week. Or maybe I'll film like one or two things, but I got enough videos for like six videos. Okay, um, so no pre-workout max. It's taking lots of pre-workouts. So, about to go to the gym, and I'm going to use this silly core stuff. Now, I managed to get this open by myself. I can't get this open. I've got to cut this little thing. Here's a little secret, guys. Always keep a knife in your room because you know you've watched a lot of movies and you never know who's gonna come in my room. Now what I would do? Usually I keep it over here, but I've had to open some stuff, so I will, you know, if I need, if someone comes in here, comes in here, you're dead. You're dead. So you know it's a safety thing. So I'm gonna have uh, maybe one to two scoops of the icy blue raz. Was really hoping they were gonna send me pink lemonade because I've never had pink lemonade. I've had icy blue raz. Really like this. Uh, I'm taking a scoop and a half of their BCAAs, so the Alpha Amino, and then I'm not really sure. Oh my God! There it goes. Did I just drop one? Oh God! Where'd the other pill go? Oh man! Am I going crazy? Okay. Well, hold on. Where the hell is the other pill? Oh my God! Well, I lost one pill. <laughs> lost a pill, hold on. Okay, so I just got another pill out of here. Even though I'm pretty sure these are super expensive, so I don't want to be losing them. So I'm sure I'll find the other pill somewhere. I'm uh, going to take these, like it says in the directions, three of these, and got my one and a half scoops. I see blue raz in there, so going to the gym now. Uh, chest day, guys. 
All right, so leaving the gym, uh, it's about 5.30. I think I might make some fish, some halibut actually, that I got from uh, Greens Bay Market. It's a, uh, you know, natural fish. And one thing that I did in this bench press workout that I wish I did film, but I realized I couldn't even film if I wanted to because I left my tripod uh, mount at Van Brawl's house in North Carolina, so he has to mail that to me. But I did a chest workout. And I did a, actually I thought like a powerlifting program. Um, the Matt, oh, I can't talk. Simon from Mastetics set me up with a kind of percentage-based program where I'm doing some pause reps, speed reps. And speed reps always get me because speed reps to me are just like, you know, not pause. Cause I'm trying, I pretty much try to go as fast as I can um, normally. Um, and then I did some wide grip bench press, which I've never done. So my hair looks so stupid and I'll do it up. So heading home now, probably see what the girlfriend's doing. I, haven't, I still haven't finished all my BCAA, so I'll finish this. This is good. Um, that's it. See you at home. Or in the next clip. Bye. All right. So it is 5.30 or 5.15 actually, and I'm making a piece of halibut. This is 7 ounces of Wild Pacific Halibut from Greensbury Market. Now keep in mind, guys, uh, halibut... By the way, take a shower. Um, halibut you can, is, a, is, a, is a cold water fish, so it's not like a fish that you can go really to like the store... Um, you know, and just buy. It's something that's really, I guess, like in season, or you go to special places, places because it is a cold water fish from the cold water oceans. And guess what? I don't live next to the cold water oceans. I don't have it regularly. If I lived in Alaska, then maybe I'd have halibut all the time. Um, I think I'm gonna have this and just. I was gonna have some rice, but I might save some carbs. Um, maybe I'll have some salad, some salad. So I'm gonna bake this for 15 minutes maybe a little longer, uh, put on some Old Bay and some lemon pepper. And there it is, guys. Let's, let's see. Oh, look at that just flaking apart. Oh my good lord. I cannot wait to eat this, dude. Halibut is my, why did I say dude? I'm not talking to anyone. Um, halibut is my favorite thing to eat. So, what I'm going to do is get in there. Come on, you devil log. Do I know what movie that's from? So we're going to put this right there. And then let me get my salad, guys. Oh, it's flaking apart. Oh, my gosh. And there it is, guys. Like, how good does that look? Max is eating healthy. So I got a uh, spring mix. Just put a whole bunch in there. And then I got a serving and a half of balsamic light dressing. Cannot wait to eat this, guys. Oh, Lord. Recording? Yes. All right. So we are in Vax's Fiesta household, and so what I'm doing is making a quesadilla with these uh, Tyson's grilled chicken. I don't know which protein, so I'm only use half of it, which is only three ounces. And I have shredded cheese, but you know it'd be it wouldn't be a good video if I just use shredded cheese. So what I'm going to do is probably make it a little complicated and use some pepper jack, two pieces, fold it up, and we are going to attempt degrade it. Does it go through the thing? Baby, you like rub it. I know how to do it. I'm saying when I, I'll figure it out. <laughs> Which one do I use? Whatever size you want. That's not really working. Hold on. Like, mm, use your muscles. Look at that, guys. So we're, step one on how to, you gotta have to gotta focus it. Is it in focus? It's focused. So you just rub it like this. So you want to put, cheese on the first layer like that I probably should have rinsed this grater <laughs> off and then woo, get down. You put the chicken on it spread it out like so keep that hot back to the grater oh yeah Oh yeah, this is gonna be pepper jacky goodness, guys. Oh yeah. Oh. Okay, that'll do. So we got all the cheese right there. Take another one that I'm using these high fiber tortilla wraps. I'm gonna put that like that, and then. Just like that, guys. So I'm gonna come back in a second. Woo! Look at that cheese melting. Quesadillas, guys, now. I think the girlfriend's gonna make one. 
She's not a fan of the uh, pepper jack cheese, though. She can't handle the spice. From a distance. Put that in your mouth. So I have tons of carbs left. Gonna eat some gold grams, which is my current favorite cereal right now. Even though I don't really like honey that much, but three servings of golden grams, two servings of fat-free skim milk, and I have about three grams of protein and oh, oh lord, uh, 50 grams of carbs and like six fat left for the whole damn day. All right, finishing up the macros, guys. More greens. You, you all never see this because uh, I needed just some fat, so I used not that light balsamic. I used some. Uh, you know, higher calorie oil and vinegar type of dressing. It had like four grams of fat per serving. So this is eight grams of fat, 48 carbs with the pretzels. It's my favorite carb kind of filler because it's just carbs. I was going to have another hot dog, but I figured that would too piss to me people off online. Uh, I'm pretty proud of these macros, guys. One is 65 fat, got 65 fat. One is 350 carb, got 350 carb. 49 fiber, two, 198 protein, 1 in 200. I mean, here's all the stuff, guys. Ooh, focus. There's the chocolate syrup, tortilla wraps, chicken, hot dogs, halibut, cookie dough, bun, ice cream, or not ice cream, yogurt, cookie dough ice cream bar, or protein bar. So, successfully tracked my macros, and again, I have to be a lot more on point because my, you know, my weight, I'm not too worried about it, but it's very, very important because I have to get this show and I paid this money, I want to be as accurate as I can in the next like five weeks on these macros. Make sure I'm the right weight so I'm not paying $80 to have to go into the weight class above me to, you know, I still could do well the 181 in the weight class, but I'm not going to want to compete at, you know, 166. So I should be fine on weight. I got five weeks. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. And, sweetie, you want to say anything? Um, no. <laughs> and no. So, uh, I'm gonna watch some American Horror Story on there. Even though I hate the dresser there, I need to move back over here. I need to still figure out a way to still have so many shaker cups and shirts and stuff. So I'll figure it out, guys. See you later.